10 bodybuilders that went too far. Number 10. Andreas Munzer. Andreas Munzer is an Austrian bodybuilder who became famous for their amazing fat to muscle ratio. On March 14, 1996, Andreas was taken to hospital after complaining about a sharp pain in his stomach. He died whilst being operated on. Doctors found many tumours on his liver and that his heart was double the size it should be. Doctors also found that he was almost 0% fat. An autopsy revealed that the various health problems were due to chemical and steroid abuse. Number 9. Bertil Fox Bertil Fox was a British bodybuilder who was famous for his amazing muscle density. He won many international and national titles for bodybuilding, winning him a large amount of money. He then moved to St Kitts Island in the Caribbean, where much of his family lived to start his very own gym with his wife. However, in 1997, he shot his wife and mother-in-law to death in the dress shop that his mother-in-law owned. He was taken to court and sent to jail for life for the double murder, despite claiming it to be in self-defence. Number 8. Arlindo de Souza In 2014, this Brazilian man injected himself with a concoction to make his arm muscle incredibly large. The concoction consisted of alcohol and oil, which he injected into his arm muscle. Immediately after the injection, his arms began to swell up. He was inspired by Arnold Schwarzenegger and wanted to further his bodybuilding career. Many have died from using the alcohol and oil substance, including Arlindo's best friend. Number 7. Mufasa Ismail Rather than having a high muscle density or a low fat ratio, Mustafa is a bodybuilder who became famous for his bizarre sized arm muscles. He has the world record for the largest arm biceps in the world, despite being average in other areas. Every day he exercises his arms for hours and consumes 8 pounds of protein, making his biceps 30 inches in diameter. Despite many saying that he uses steroids or injects synthol into his arms, Mustafa claims that he has achieved the arms from hard work and dedication. Number 6. Nasser El Sombati This German bodybuilder became incredibly famous in the bodybuilding world. He won many competitions and was frequently featured in bodybuilding magazines. On the 20th of March 2013, Nasir died in his sleep after being ill for many months with breathing problems. A combination of the bodybuilding lifestyle and steroid abuse caused Nasir to die at the premature age of 47. Number 5. Gordon Kimbra This bodybuilder from San Francisco wasn't happy with his muscles, so he began to use steroids and growth hormones. He was described as a shy, mild-mannered man prior to the drugs, however in 1996, he went ballistic due to the heavy drug use. This resulted in him killing his fiancée because he was paranoid she was cheating on him. Police found his dead wife at the scene with him next to her attempting to commit suicide. He was charged with 27 years to life for the murder. Number 4. Candice Armstrong In 2013, this 28 year old bodybuilder from London said that her use of steroids had turned her into a man. She began to develop facial hair, acne and various other male characteristics. She even grew a 1 inch male reproductive organ. It was revealed that the changes were due to her injecting too much testosterone and hormones. Despite the shock you may assume she had, she says that she will continue to use the drug as it has improved her life. Number 3. Greg Valentino Greg was once the holder of the record for the world's largest arms. Unlike the current record holder, he openly admits to using synthol injections. He did this because he was unhappy at the rate of growth with the amount of work that he was putting in. Because of the extensive pumping of synthol into his arms, he began to develop a hematoma and his arm began to leak synthol. He then attempted to drain out the synthol with a syringe, causing the bicep to explode in a bloody mess. Number 2. Gary Hemming Australian bodybuilder Gary Hemming was competing in the Masters Division at the International Federation of Bodybuilding Tournament in Canada when he collapsed on stage. He then died on stage in front of a large audience. It is unknown whether the death was due to steroid use or because of the general strain of being a bodybuilder. Despite his death, the show went on, leaving many audience members traumatised. Number 1. Sally McNeil Ex-marine and bodybuilder Sally McNeil was known for being one of the most insane bodybuilders ever. She was incredibly jealous and would beat up other women in fear that they would look at her husband. She also once dropped an 80 pound weight on her husband's car after she wrongfully suspected him of cheating. However, in 1996, things went way too far when she shot her husband in the chest with a shotgun. It was later revealed that she suffered from rage caused by the steroids and was sentenced to life in prison. 
Thanks for watching. Here are some more videos you might like, and don't forget to subscribe.